After another day of Britain's Got Talent auditions, at the London Palladium, Simon Cowell and Bruno Tonioli left in high spirits on Saturday. The 64-year-old music magnate dismissed yet another day of peculiar auditions after the program had a dramatic beginning this week when the police were called to deal with an intruder. Simon grinned and crossed his arms as he departed the premises with fellow talent show judge Bruno trailing closely behind. He dressed in his go-to-black, pullover, and baggy pants, finishing the look with a pair of orange-tinted glasses. Bruno, 68, on the other hand, wore a striking fur coat with an animal motif and paired it with baggy black pants. In addition, the eccentric choreographer chose to appear naked, as evidenced by the way he left his coat undone to flaunt his tanned chest. He added even more accessories, including a gold chain necklace and a pair of black sunglasses. Before leaving for the evening, Bruno is seen in the photos waiting and conversing with admirers. This comes after a female intruder was escorted off by police from the Britain's Got Talent set at the London Palladium on Wednesday after she tried to go backstage to view Simon and Amanda Holden among the judges. Claiming to have attempted to sneak past security and enter the restricted area, the unnamed woman was seen with her hood up. London Ambulance Service and officers were present. Officers helped the woman and made arrangements for a family member to meet her. No offenses were committed. Police were dealing with an individual outside of the Palladium who was causing a bit of a stir, a Fremantle representative continued. The BGD team helped out. However, because BGD refrained from calling the police, the judges were not in danger, and they were not inside the Palladium. Theater employees were reportedly heard chatting among themselves as an intruder tried to sneak in backstage to view Simon and his famous colleagues. After the intruder caused confusion, the popular televised talent show's auditions were postponed, reportedly in an effort to identify the country's next big star. Officers flanked her as she was led out of the theater, dressed in a hooded tracksuit top. Following the event, a small group of people gathered outside the stage door, with security personnel stationed nearby, and officers were observed conversing with door staff at the theater. As contestants went to the London Palladium to showcase their talents in an attempt to advance through the program, the judges and hosts had a busy week. The auditions began this week on Wednesday afternoon, and they had a packed schedule, with two blocks of audition shows every day, until Sunday. At the beginning of February, they will go to Manchester for an additional five days of auditions, which will take place at the Central Convention Centre. The forthcoming 17th season of Britain's Got Talent has not yet been given an official premiere date.